Okay, so we're getting you excited about fall, and we know most of the time people think about fall, we think about sports, football, of course, racebacks have a game this weekend. Yep. A lot of people out there tailgating. So, if you're looking for maybe an alternative to some tailgating snacks, that's where I, for our friend Betsy is here from Fayetteville Athletic Club. We're going to be talking about some healthy swaps when it comes to your tailgate. Is that right, Betsy? Yes, absolutely. This all smells delicious, by oh, the way. What right. can, what can I eat so as you talk? Good. Can oh, I have you can apples? eat any of it. So. Um, one of the best things that you can do before you go to a tailgate, we know that it's a lot of snacks, it's a lot of stuff. Eat, don't go starving, eat before <laughs> you go so that then you can just kind of snack and not try to fill yourself up on okay. all the stuff. However, you want to take some things that everybody's going to enjoy but are a little bit better for us, okay? okay. so. We have traded out our sandwiches for some roll-ups. Okay, everybody has done a roll-up before. We've put a lot of sure. veggies in here. Veggies are gonna give us a lot of different nutritional value, um, as well as fill us up a little bit more with some fiber. And we've traded it out for a Carb Smart tortilla, oh, okay. right? So okay, now we fancy. have reduced the sodium, we've added fiber. People maybe want to, may, may want to know. Do these taste the same? They do. Okay, good to They know. really do. They're so good. Um, so that's easy. You can spice it up with some pepper. Some avocado is a okay. good fat to keep you full. We've made meatballs. Very, very oh. common um, tailgate snack. But instead, today we have used actually a meat alternative. Okay. And then we have snuck some veggies in there as well. Okay. Zhuzhed it up with a sugar-free but high flavor sauce. Mm -hmm. So barbecue sauce tends to have a lot of sugar and salt in it. Just trade it out. You can keep the flavor, but give yourself still a lot of sauce okay. there. I like okay. That. Um, we are going to make some ca some uh, cowboy caviar. I so, love a good dip. Betsy. Right, dips. Everybody loves a dip. This one is high in fiber, low in fat. We have some good fats in there. Plus, we eat with our eyes. We eat with our nose. Mm -hmm. It's got a lot of great colors. It's got a lot of great smells to it. So in here, we have black eyed peas and black beans. Okay, so here's the thing with anything that you take from a can. Okay. One of the beautiful things people love about this is it's easy because it all comes from a can. Well, cans have a lot of sodium in them. Okay. So I used black eyed peas from the frozen food section. I used corn from the frozen food section. Okay. No sodium in those. I'm going to add salt to it as I flavor it anyway. Okay. Uh, black beans kind of hard to find unless you make them on your own. Rinse them off. Okay, so I've added my corn, I've added my black eyed peas, my black beans. Okay. I'm gonna add some avocado so I have a good fat in there to give it just another little flavor. All right. Fresh bell peppers, peppers and onions. Yes, um, adding all of that color, some tomatoes in there. So we're gonna stir that up and then our sauce is a lot of seasoning. Mm. We have chili powder, smoked paprika, garlic powder, oh, nice. some salt, some pepper. Okay. The big thing here, red wine vinegar and lime juice. Huh. Okay. Um, and that brings out a lot of the right? flavor. Right? Okay. That's going to pop up a lot of our flavor. If you like cilantro, add cilantro to it. Not everybody does. Um, I like to keep the tomatoes and the bell peppers big. Not all my kids like tomatoes and bell peppers. They want to be able to, to sneak those out of there. Right? So good. You can do it with a blue corn tortilla mm -hmm. chip. Blue corn has a lower glycemic index than a yellow corn tortilla chip. So it's not going to spike, spike your blood sugar the same way. You're okay. going to be able to, to eat a little bit more of that. Um, a pita thin has less fat so in good. it, right, mm -hmm. than a regular chip does. Or they've even come out with these new partly air fried. Okay. So you can still get the goodness of that um, kettle cooked chip, right? But with a little less. I'm not gonna lie, this uh, cowboy dip is really good, Betsy. I'm just right? gonna just break off a little oh, bit more you here. Oh, going. Let's bring up some information on how you can mm -hmm. get in contact with Betsy at FAC. There's information right there on your screen. Betsy also has got some fruit here, some alternatives to even what you're drinking, maybe spice up um, your waters with some fresh fruit as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. Betsy, thank you so much for joining us today. Of course. You're leaving the cowboy dip for me. I'm going to leave right? that for you. You eat it as much as you Perfect. want. Perfect. Thank you. All right. Well, coming up.